Hi, welcome to Amster. Today I'll be viewing this portable charger. This one's got a built-in solar panel on the back. It's made by Student. And here's the manual for it. If you want to read any part more detail, just feel free to pause the video. I also placed the information in the description below. Now this one has two USB ports. I can charge smartphones, tablets at the same time if I wanted. There's also an LED indicator right on top over here that tells me how much capacity is left. Uh, some of the interesting things, this manual, well, let me take a look at the wording over here. This device is not suitable for physically or mentally sick person. It came with this little carabiner clip, also a micro USB cable, which I have right over here. It's about a foot in length. On the top, output one, output two, in the middle. This is the input for charging the device. When there's direct sunlight, just take a look at the LED indicator. And you can see that it's charging right now. This little strap, this strap is not removable. I can place another strap here if I wanted, but the strap that came with it, can't remove it. There's also an LED light. I'm just gonna tap the power button twice. Tap it again, now it's flashing. One more time, now it's off. I got both my smartphones plugged in. My Samsung phone is charging. It's probably too bright to show up. And for my iPhone, it's also charging. I have really no complaints about this. The item works. Um, most of the time, I'm charging the battery bank by using the micro USB input. The solar charger, this is more for like emergency situations because this is really a trickle charge. It would take me days to charge this to full capacity, whereas if I were to just use the micro USB, I can charge within five, six hours. This was a student 12,000 milliamp capacity solar charger portable battery bank. I like it and I recommend it. Thanks for watching this review. If you guys have any questions, comments, suggestions, feel free to contact me. Thanks for watching Walker Hamster.